Hey all, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is the Dell Canvas hands-on impressions, um, not the full review, that's still incoming. Um, right now it's four in the morning and I'm using my cell phone to record this, which is kind of all indicative of how crazy this last week has been. You guys, I'm sorry I haven't had the videos that I wanted to have up for you, but I'm doing the best I can with the crazy life that we have this week. And right now I'm just gonna show you a little bit about, you know, just talk to you a little bit about the, the canvas and my impressions so far and show you a little bit about just a kind of drawing on it. it has amazing pressure sensitivity as you can imagine it feels incredibly light in hand and the pen just sort of floats across the screen it's just nice as you could ever want it to be to draw on. Um, the pen is nice and light but it still has some substance to it it's got a great feel soft touch plastic on the the grippy part that you would actually be handling metal on the other end um, the little totem which you can see in the lower part of the screen, I'm doing my best to hold the cell phone relatively still as I'm doodling, um, is also really nice in hand and that thing has, um, that accessory, that thing, has, um, uh, it's both clickable and rotatable, so two physical operations, the rotation can go in obviously both directions and those operations can be pre-programmed, or, or come pre-programmed but can also be set up with some custom command so really great sort of keyboard replacement option there still becoming intuitive for me at this point it's not uh, super intuitive but I'm you know I'm getting there with it I like it um, beyond that let me just say that I like the canvas's build quality I think it's the kind of thing that feels like you could almost sit on it you know it's really heavy really durable really big big huge frame around the drawing surface lets you lean into your work has soft touch plastic as a sort of bevel that says hey uh, this thing is big and burly but it's not going to break your stuff and you don't have to worry about it um, the pen has like a magnetic the, the screen or the pen are kind of magnetized so that, you know, there's little um, portions of the side of the screen you can kind of just stick your pen and not worry about it slipping around um, you can see I'm rotating right now the little um, totem and you can see that it does infinite undo and redo and that is super cool um, you can set up to do a bunch of other stuff too, but for right now, that's my favorite. Um, the screen, bright, beautiful, accurate colors, nice pixel density, but not too much pixel density. It's going to stress your, your system out if you've got two or three monitors. Um, everything about it's awesome. Up at the top, you've got uh, right up here, you have a button on the underside that lets you turn touch on, off or on. There's a menu button over here. And a power button on the far side, but other you know, other than those three concealed buttons, there's nothing on the screen but the screen itself, your totem, and then the stylus. So it's just a clean workspace to do a lot of cool art, and it's big and immersive and well built. So far, my impressions are really good. Um, right now, I'm in the middle of testing it uh, on my home computer, testing it on multiple computers at the office, and we're just trying to make sure that we've kind of got our bases covered with what to to talk about in the review. The um, software side of things is interesting because there's these fences, which is um, sort of a desktop overlay. And then there's also like, you can say grab a file here and you'll see that there's, uh, maybe I'll show you that part later because I'm not super familiar with it yet. But there's this way of interfacing between dragging and dropping between multiple screens and all kinds of stuff. So um, cool, cool uh, software layer that's worth exploring. But more important to me is just how does it feel to draw with? and um, that experience is pretty wonderful and, um, and really rewarding. I'll talk more about it as we get into this weekend and hopefully I'll have more time that I'm not recording with my cell phone and not talking to you while it's four in the morning and I'm super exhausted, but hopefully this video is like a kickstart toward getting that done and um, gives you guys some initial impressions if you're still sitting at the Dell.com website and you know waiting to add to cart. So um, my initial impressions are positive. It's a thumbs up for sure. And I just want to be able to give you a more nuanced look at everything that it has to do with the device. And um, I'll do my best to get that to you as soon as possible. Thanks for understanding around the time. Thanks for understanding around using that I'm using my cell phone to record this. And thanks for understanding that um, at 4 in the morning, I'm not the most eloquent speaker. So take care and have a wonderful, wonderful Thursday and Friday. And hopefully I'll be talking to you on Saturday with more impressions. Take care.